I think we need a cruise car club. What's a cruise car club? We get about eight more people that have cruises and we have a club and we don't do anything but we call it a club. Cruise car club. Huh? Cruise car club. Can we meet once a month in a random parking lot and we talk about our cars even though they're all exactly alike? Cruise Control Car uh, Club, four C's, C Quad, rather than C Squad. <laughs> ah! See what I did there? Nice. I'm a genius. That that Webster Dictionary coming out in you. I'm telling you. Y'all should stop on McDonald's and get Kylie a um, McDouble and fries while you're out. You got a stimulus check, he'd get her a whole half a meal. Well, she'd probably have, rather have to pay double on fries, unless the happy meal's gonna come with the um, Shopkins toy. You get more fries if you double on fries. We'll see. I mean, I'll stop. I just don't know. We'll see what I get. I love her sweet tea. Yeah. Their large sweet tea is not as big as it used to be. Yeah, you know, it's kind of a little upset about it. I wanted to write some letters. I miss the supersized days. Yo, yeah. The large fries now is a supersize. It's the same size as the supersize was back then. Yeah, but I just like the whole getting to the drive through, getting to the supersize. Getting to the actual speaker and saying, Give me a number four. Super sizing. Or, or when you get a meal and they say, would would you like to super size it for 30 cents more? Of course I would like to super size it for 30 cents more. Even if you didn't have the 30 cents more. If you super size it. We should do a show where we just hit drive throughs We should do a show where we just hit drive throughs And we both drive Chevy Cruises. But what would we call them? <laughs> Cruise control. Nice. We should try the flaming hot taco from Taco Bell. They have a flaming hot taco. Yeah, it's a, a Doritos. Uh, oh, oh, flaming Doritos taco. You want to do that first? Is that our first gig? I kind of want to. I mean, it don't have to be first, but I do want to do it though. Oh, I thought of an idea. So, we were talking about money and spending on doing this <laughs> yeah. because of the fact we'll be going to random and trying random things on the menu and just seeing or giving our opinions on it. And even if we don't like it, eat it anyway. We can use coupons. Did you just say coupons? We, we can use coupons. I get coupons in the mail if someone underneath your floor. I mean, if someone you underneath your feet on the floor. And like, they have coupons for Is that how you really say it? I like to say coupons, not coupons. Coupons. And I'm the Webster's Dictionary. And we can use coupons to save money. You keep saying it like over and over and over again. But it's a fun word to say. Like, we should order the foot long taco from Barachi and get it to go and then so do you say grouping group on <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense <laughs> that's sort of like some gray pooping <laughs> gray gray pooping. Pooping. <laughs> would you have like any gray poop on please sir <laughs> all right thank y'all you're at your destination don't forget to get your daughter something to eat yeah she wants a large sweet I'll tea and a mac double dustin will you help me dustin help me remember yeah thanks like, like he'll forget we're in Walmart when we get in Walmart. I'll forget why we're there. Bye, y'all. Come on, potato chips and creamer. <laughs> and thumbtacks. And thumbtacks. <laughs> Facts.
Ooh. And a good toaster. Oh man, no. Come on. <laughs> You know what I got in the car? I got some black electrical tape you can put on the back of it to hold it down. That's not a bad idea. I mean, it'll look ghetto, but ain't nobody seen it way over in the corner. I like that view. I do too. I know some YouTubers who do it from their car, they're not using their phone. I don't know. I don't know what the heck they use. Not the ones that do it in the car. Like, I don't, I mean, I don't know. I've seen some of those cameras that, uh, that do it more of a casual Sunday style, but not, not, uh, I haven't seen any in the car. I don't know what they use. I mean, the phone makes sense to me because you can have the phone uh, holder, you know, but I don't know why. I turned right here. I could have just gone straight. I was going to say that. I, I, no, as I was making the turn, I was like, I, I could go straight. I, it'd probably I did. Safe. I did. I, first thing I did when I woke up today, I went to Walmart. The same Walmart we're going to. And I did exact same thing you just did and I got about right here away. Why the heck did I take the right? Man, now I gotta sit through all these red lights. This is the longest day. one. Yeah, oh, I know. But then when you get down to the interstate over there, there's like one like every five feet. Yeah, because if I would have went down there, they, oh, right on past the gulag, I just go straight shot. Yep. Okay, so like, so are we seriously going to sit here and agree that San Miguel's at fifty percent occupancy? Yeah, no, yeah, that is definitely not fifty. No, occupancy. that's not fifty percent. But I tell you what, I don't care. We went there two weeks ago when they opened up. When they, because for a while they weren't doing anything, but they started, two weeks ago they started doing the curbside. That ain't fifty percent, bro. We ordered our food on the phone, right? We pulled in, and there was a line coming out of here, out, out on the highway nine. And we all we pulled up, and we said, "Man, this line is forever." So Christy called, placed an order on the phone, and we gave them a description of the car, and they were like, "Are you here?" I'm like, "No." We did a minute. <laughs> I literally, she's over here in the passenger seat, using my car, and she was like, no, and I'm looking at her all crazy, like, we over here, she's like, I'm like, okay, so I'm like, I'm doing a U-turn, get out of the place, and I'm like, where are we going, she's like, I'm going to go to McDonald's, and get the kids something, because I ain't going to eat nothing from here, by the time we get back, But it didn't take that long. I didn't care, man, because I was missing some Mexican man. I, no, I would have said, yeah, I'm here. They probably would have brought it right up to you. No, nah, it took too long. Yeah, like I said, it wasn't ready when we got back. We were gone for like a half hour. Because McDonald's was busy, too. We sat in that drive through forever. And I, that's why I was like, man, they're going to be waiting on us. Our food's going to be cold. Nope. We got there, sat in a line still. Dude came out to our car, asked us if we wanted to order. We're like, we already have this on there. We, we already we ordered on the phone. Gave our name or whatever. Came back down. Was like, <coughs> it's gonna be about ten more minutes. <coughs> I'm like, all right. It's about fifteen, but I ain't cared, man. Like I said, I I've been wanting some Mexican forever, so I was happy to have it. I haven't gone in any like uh, place. I went to. Uh, I broke down Saturday. Went to Fusaki Saturday. Like that's the only drive through I've been through. Yeah. Since since, since all this started. Yeah, it was so good. It was so delicious. So if you get McDonald's on the way back, man, I hadn't had McDonald's in two months. Yeah. Like easy two and a half months. 
I ain't had a hamburger, a fast food hamburger so long. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> Is there anything at McDonald's you've never eaten? I don't know. Like, I haven't sat and thought about, you know, what their menu is or, like, looked at the menu and said, I've never had that before. Plus, if I have, or, hold on, let me phrase that. If I say that I haven't, I might be lying because I probably have years ago and don't remember that. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean. Man, I don't think there's anything at McDonald's, man. See, see, McDonald's, I don't think there's anything I've never had. Now, Burger King, yeah. Oh, yeah. Burger King's trash. Yeah. H Hardee's, yes. I mean, their Whopper is... I, this is my opinion. The Whopper is better than anything McDonald's has. It's the best burger. Or uh, one of the best burgers in fast food. I, but I, the I rest of the McDonald's menu is way better than anything Burger King has. This I don't know, opinion. because... Because depending on who's working the grill, even though it's a frozen patty, <laughs> but, <laughs> even though it's a frozen the patty, grill, man, it's, it's key here. <laughs> but like, if it was working the grill, like I have gone to some McDonald's and and like order a double quarter pounder, and it's been like, ah, uh, you know, that's all right. You know, I can tell that, you know, that's, you know, uh, no, I mean, it was, it was okay. But, it, but I've gone to some McDonald's and ordered a double quarter pounder. And I've been like, man, that was legit. Like, I wish I had another one. Yeah. Like, I don't know the dude seasoned it right. Or like, or like, you know, he pulled it off like 10 seconds before the timer went off. Real man, Keith. But like. It, Real man at Burger King. <laughs> but you know, you know the dude at McDonald's is probably like. You know he's bra you know he brags about that. Like, what do you do, McDonald's? I'm a grill man. What? Yeah. I, I put frozen patties on. Did the gym not open yet? Yeah, they're supposed to open up yesterday. Planet Fitness ain't open. Like, you worried. <laughs> I, well, I just thought, I didn't see nobody out there in the parking lot. I didn't see no cars. I'm like, man, they closed. I thought they opened. <laughs> like, you've been, like, you've been dying. Gotta get back in. to the gym. Like, huh? you've been dying to go in. Oh, <laughs> Let me redo uh -oh. this. Membership from 12 years. <laughs> 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 Gotta get back, man. You know? It's been too long. <laughs> I haven't gone to gym in 20 years. Quarantine's over. Let's hop in. <laughs> <laughs> Quarantine's over. Gotta get back stacked. <laughs> Gotta get cut. But first, let me go to McDonald's and get a double quarter pound. Right. You know, in a super size fry. Stop by Burger King and get that waffle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's one thing you're dying to do once quarantine is over? Get back in the gym. Oh, were you seriously in the gym a lot? Yeah. What's the last time you went? Uh, September of 01. <laughs> <laughs> Right out of high school. <laughs> you graduate in 96. <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> no. I've had a lot going on in my life. I had to keep them mentally yeah. prepared. <laughs> it took you 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> Things just don't happen overnight. <laughs> takes time. It, it takes time. It takes preparation. Preparation, right. There you go. I had to get my money right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That ten dollars a month—that's a commitment. <laughs> but I need them cigarettes, though. Park next to that truck, you know your car ain't getting broken into at all. <laughs> you park next to that truck, your car ain't getting broken into at all. They gonna steal whatever is in the back of his truck. Don't even think about yours. Yep.